Hello everyone, welcome back to the question answer discussion session. So today's question is, which of the following is polyoxyethylene sorbitan monosteroid? A choice, twin 20, B choice, twin 40, C choice, twin 60, D choice, twin 80, and E choice, span 80. So from this choice, first you need to understand what kind of uh, compound they are, tweens and spans. So basically they are surfactants, they are surfactant compounds. So surfactant means they can decrease the surface tension. Surfactant is also called as surface active, active agents, surface active agents or surfactants. They have the ability to decrease the surface tension. Now tween and span, it's coming to the tween and span, they are surfactant as we told they are surfactant, tweens and spans, they are surfactants and uh, surfactants are of different types like anionic surfactant is there, cationic surf surfactant is there. However, tween and span belongs to a category called as non-ionic surfactant, non-ionic surfactant. So teens and spans are examples for non-ionic surfactants. Now let us look at uh, each of this uh, example. Let's take span as the first example. Span. So span, they are actually non-ionic surfactant and it is an ester. It is an ester compound. It is an ester compound. Now what is an ester? Ester is basically, you know that it is formed by the uh, combination of the hydroxyl group and the carboxyl group. So hydroxy group and the carboxyl group combine to form or condense to form the ester compound. Okay, so span is uh, is basically an ester. Span also, and as well as tene is also an ester actually. Now, the ester of which alcoholic group and which carboxyl group? So, so span, is, the alcoholic group comes from this a compound called as sorbitan, and the carboxyl group comes from the COH of fatty acids. fatty acid. So the, that means span is the ester compound or ester of alcoholic group of sorbitan and the acid group of fatty acids. Now there are different types of uh, spans. Uh, one is a span 20, the bottom ones are span 20, span 40, span 60 and span 80. Now the difference, uh, uh, what about the difference in this number is based on the which fatty acids are. Okay, so if it is 20, the fatty acid will be basically, the, the fatty acid will be lauric acid. If it is 40, the fatty acid will be palmitic acid. And if the number is 60, the fatty acid will be stearic acid. And if the number is 80, the fatty acid will be oleic acid. Okay. So you please remember 20, 40, 60, 80. You can remember this mnemonic LPSO, LPSO. So uh, if it is 20, it is L, 40, P, 60, S and 80. Okay. LPSO. Okay. So this number 20, 40, 60, 80 indicates the fatty acids used. Okay, fatty acids in that particular compound. Okay, so once again we revise, uh, span is the ester of the alcoholic group of sorbitan and the acid group of fatty acids and mainly lauric acid, palmitic acid, stearic acid and oleic acids are the fatty acids involved. Let's look at uh, each of the span. So the first one we told is um, span 20. Span 20. So span 20, as I already told, it is an ester of sorbitan and the fatty acid. So it is called as sorbitan sorbitan monolaurate so span 20 is chemically sorbitan monolaurate whereas span 40 is sorbitan monopalmitate whereas span 60 is sorbitan monosteroid whereas span 80 is chemically sorbitan monoileate 
okay so i uh, told you l p s o 20 40 60 80 so it is chemically sorbit and mono fatty acid ester sorbit and mono laureate mono palmitic mono stearate and mono oleate so that is the difference between span 20 40 60 and 80 now coming to the next uh, non ionic surfactant that is um, uh, tweens the first thing you need to understand if you add to the span surfactant if you add uh, a 20 molecules of 20 molecules of ethylene oxide 20 molecules of ethylene oxide into the the span surfactant that it will become tween so tween is nothing but the combination of span plus 20 molecules of ethylene oxide one more point you need to remember when you add this ethylene oxide when you add this ethylene oxide the water solubility will increase so ethylene oxide will increase the water solubility increase the water solubility so ethylene oxide uh, increase the water solubility therefore tweens are more soluble compared to span tweens are more soluble compared to the span component because teens contains teen surfactant contains ethylene oxide ethylene oxide increases the water solubility so among span and tween if the question is which is more water soluble the answer is uh, tween now let us look at uh, the different types of uh, tweens so just uh, uh, like what we have mentioned for the span tweens are of tween 20 tween 40 tween 60 tween 80 so here uh, apart from the sorbitan groups apart from the sorbitan group that ethylene oxide has come since 20 ethylene oxide has come we will call it as poly poly compounds poly oxyethylene so uh, tween 20 is poly oxyethylene because 20 molecules of ethylene oxide are there so poly oxyethylene the remaining part will be the span that is sorbitan mono and whenever 20 comes the fatty acid will be yeah, which one yes laureate so mono laureate so tween 20 is chemically poly oxyethylene sorbitan mono laureate simply sorbitan mono laureate i told you it is span 20 now if you add 20 molecules of ethylene oxide it will become uh, tween 20 similarly uh, tween 40 is poly oxyethylene sorbitan mono yes 40 means it will be palmitic mono palmitic similarly tween 60 will be poly oxyethylene sorbitan mono stearate and 80 will be poly oxyethylene sorbitan mono yes 80 stands for oleate oleate okay so you can remember l p s o 20 40 60 80 only thing if it is span you can just write sorbitan the chemical name will be sorbitan mono fatty acid whatever fatty acid if it is tween you need to add the word poly oxyethylene you need to add poly oxyethylene along with the span that is sorbitan okay so that is the difference between tween surfactant and um, uh, span surfactant now coming back to our question uh, which of the following is uh, poly oxyethylene sorbitan so simply uh, simply sor sorbitan monosterate means sorbitan stearate means it will be span it will be span and uh, as i told you lpso 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 stearate will come at the 60 so it will be span 60 now if you add a poly oxyethylene group to this if you add a poly ethylene oxide or ethylene oxide to this thing span 60 will become tween 60 so the correct answer for this question will be c choice tween 60 okay thank you